here's the spinner it's just a rotary encoder that I wire up to microcontroller that I program to act as a mouse and it's just the x-axis um, straight through cable run to your PC or to your RetroPie or whatever machine you're using it's free spinning but not long spinning um, there's no counterweight on it the only added weight is whatever knob you have on there um, the one that I'm getting in right now is I believe 44 millimeters by 22 millimeters high and uh, I forget the weight but it's heavier than the one I'm using here and it also has smooth sides rather than the uh, uh, diamond cut some people find this not too comfortable um, but as far as gameplay goes uh, let's see Here, let's let's do a driving game. And once you have the settings in your tab menu, um, which I can show you, make sure your input is set to your mouse if you're using multi mouse. Make sure it's the right one. Um, and under analog controls, you want to set your dial sensitivity according to the sheet I provide here. It's a calculation based on uh, the website at uh, arcadecontrols.com. So I figured all these out already and gave you the sheet to make it easier for you. And once that's set in each game, it's much more like the real arcade feel. Especially, I'm going to go ahead and add a steering wheel to it. Of course, doesn't mean it makes me a better player. That's it.